Windows on ARM just took a huge leap forward, Fortnite is finally running natively. If you own a Snapdragon X laptop, this is big news. Let's break down what changed, how it performs, and what it means for gaming on ARM devices. Until now, Fortnite didn't run properly on ARM-based Windows devices. But with the latest update, version 38.00, released on November 1st, Epic quietly enabled full ARM64 support through their new Easy Anti-Cheat system. Previously, Epic's anti-cheat system wasn't compatible with ARM, so Fortnite simply wouldn't launch. But after updating the EOS SDK earlier this year, developers can now enable ARM64 support, and Epic finally did it. When tested on a Snapdragon X Elite laptop, Fortnite ran surprisingly well, around 60 FPS at performance settings, with only minor texture lag during early matches. Qualcomm has often said their chips aren't meant for gaming, but this update shows how versatile they can be. You can now enjoy all-day battery life and light gaming on the same device. It's not just Fortnite. Microsoft also upgraded Prism, the Windows on ARM emulator. It now supports AVX and AVX2 instructions, meaning more 64-bit x86 apps and even more games will now run better. To make sure AVX support is enabled, right-click any apps.exe file, Open Properties Compatibility Windows ARM Compatibility, and check Show Newer Emulated CPU Features. This is a big win for Windows on ARM. With Fortnite running natively and more apps being supported, Snapdragon X laptops are finally becoming serious all-round devices. What game do you want to see next on ARM? If you found this update exciting, hit that like button, subscribe for more tech updates, and let me know in the comments. Will you be trying Fortnite on your Snapdragon laptop?